Hi, this is John Volker for High Gear Media, and I'm at the wheel of the smallest electric car sold in America. This is the 2012 Mitsubishi i. We're in an SE model, which is in an unusual color of plum that makes it distinctive, although almost impossible to photograph. We're in New York City today. This is a car that has a 63 mile EPA range. Uh, we got it with about 60 miles, and one of the, the mm, drawbacks of this car is that when you're in 80 and 90 degree temperatures, as we are in New York City today, in fact, uh, the range goes down to something like the low 40s. This is actually a very small car. It's uh, a mini car. Uh, it's a class of cars really usually only sold in Japan, but because the battery is in the floor pan and under the rear seat and deck, it actually makes a fairly good electric car. It's small in traffic, but uh, fairly maneuverable, and it has a very tight turning circle. We're going to go today from Manhattan, where we are now, to City Island, which is a nautical community off the Bronx. We're echoing a recent video from Jerry Seinfeld uh, from his series Comedians in Cars Getting Coffee. So we're going to go off to City Island. One of the questions we had about the Mitsubishi I was how much power it actually had for real world driving. We are about to accelerate at speed onto Manhattan's notorious FDR Drive along the east side. This is the road that so terrified Ricky Gervais when he was riding in Jerry Seinfeld's vintage Austin Healey. The Mitsubishi I actually does have useful acceleration. It's not the quickest electric car we've driven by far, but the torque of an electric motor, even a relatively small one, really stands out here. And it conducts itself fine at speeds of, say, 50 miles an hour. Uh, we haven't had a chance, nor are we likely to, to drive it at speeds more like 75 miles an hour, not in and around New York City anyway. But uh, thus far, it's very usable in town. 